This is the Serial Wombat PCB0020, and it is a simple breakout board that is designed to provide power through a USB port from a USB power supply or battery, and provide those on these pins with the ability to bridge the pins at the top to this first row. And what this means is that this board is very good at providing power to other things and also as a convenient breakout for servos. Note that this board has no electronics on it. Uh, it is designed to simply be a physical connector and so that your Serial Wombat 18AB chip or your Arduino or Raspberry Pi can be used to control servos through this board uh, with a separate power supply. I wired one of those up a moment ago and let's take a look at it real quick. This is a Serial Wombat 18AB board that has been outfitted with the uh, ESP01 module for IoT applications. We have one of the PCB0020 USB power breakout boards and a couple of standard SG90 servos. We're going to take and hook up a power supply battery to that. And we'll see, as soon as I turn this on, we'll see the servos oscillate because that's the Arduino sketch that's been loaded into this ESP01, which in turn is controlling the servo controllers on the Serial Wombat chip. And that's about it. As you can see, the wiring is very nice and neat. Uh, the servos plug in nicely. And then the control lines are coming to the servos through this breakout board from the Serial Wombat chip that's on this PCB. This particular board is very good for low power applications, uh, up to a couple of amps. The sort of thing that you might do with these little SG90s, if you were doing animatronics, uh, instrumentation, things along those lines. If you're gonna look for a breakout board for beefier applications, such as RC electronics or uh, servos that are used in robotics, then I would look at the other Serial Wombat servo breakout board uh, that includes tie downs to go to a stronger power supply that also gives you the ability to drive six volts or higher as opposed to this board which since it uses usb is pretty much fixed at five